All right, diving into one of my favorite series is the mystery mail videos. Each of these parcels purchased um, two years ago, over two years ago. Uh, and uh, I throw up up here what I paid for them. And then we see how they did, how they, uh, how they performed. So uh, we're gonna add to the counter on the right hand side there based on what these last sold for. Uh, and in here, uh, it looks like we've got something that I'm gonna skip ahead to opening up. All right, so in this one, we actually start with four Mike Vernons, which at the time of purchasing this, he was not in the Hockey Hall of Fame and now he is. But behind that, we had a bunch of CHL cards. I love the CHL cards. These are all numbered out of 199. So we've got Oliver Suni, who I believe is back in Finland. Uh, and then we've got uh, Pavel Novak, who is, uh, uh, again, I believe in Europe. If not, he's, uh, he's, in, the, he's in the junior, or sorry, in the, um, in the AHL or ECHL there going back and forth. Uh, but the big one that I was after, Zane Franklin here, captain of the Blazers. He had a great rookie year with the uh, University of Saskatchewan, a sizzler sensation for my PC uh, before he went pro. Uh, and is now in the AHL, having, uh, having doing pretty decent. Uh, great start there, a nice PC card. And we'll get into parcel number two, and we will throw up on the left there what we paid for this one, and we will start adding to our counter. And right off the bat, I see a player I like. Let's see if it's all this player, and look at that, it looks like it is. So we've got Miko Rantanen, Rookie Materials, uh, so that is a great jersey card. It is followed up by another rookie fabrics. This one is called from SPX. Very nice. And then we get into the rookie premieres. This would be from Premier, the uh, the pretty uh, pretty elite high end product. Uh, Miko Arantanen. And then we finish off here with. Uh, some marquee rookies so it's just the base ones but we've also got a rookie portraits uh so yeah no uh no parallel on that one uh so three very strong rantanen cards uh jersey cards and then three other rookie cards so six rookie cards of miko rantanen uh i feel like i would have gotten a pretty good deal on this he's been having some great seasons ever since uh, these were purchased two years ago uh so i have a feeling that number is going to be quite a bit higher than it was than the number on the left there uh, but we are going to bounce right along into parcel number three and we're going to throw up on the left side there what we paid for this one and let's go ahead in and see what we've got inside uh, we are going to skip ahead to getting everything out all right so in this one we've got two of just the base rookies of uh, the marquee rookies of kale mccarr uh, so not a crazy card there, but Kale McCarr is a is a uh, is a good name to grab on the rookies, and especially a product like Platinum, where I think uh, this will rise over time. Uh, so I don't know. I would say that it's not uh, fluctuated too too much, um, but uh, good cards to sit on. Well, McCarr slowly has a career that uh, that rivals some of the best D-men to ever play the game. Uh, is the plan so we'll see about that but uh, we'll get into our last parcel of the day and let's see who we're gonna find inside right on the top there it is going to be look at that we've got our Temi Panarin beauty young guns card looks like it's in quite a good shape uh, I again this would be one that might not have fluctuated too much but he is a top 10 scorer so I wouldn't be surprised if that number is a little bigger than this number over here and uh, overall I think we did pretty good on the day I'm glad to have gotten a sizzler sensation for the PC we picked up Makar and Ranton and some great Colorado players and then finished off with a top 10 scorer right now in Panarin not a bad haul at all and uh, as always really appreciate you tuning in take care